Hello, um, welcome to <clears throat> this is Car Consult and uh, <laughs> welcome to the part two of Road Science. I think on our <clears throat> in the part one we did warning road signs which gives warning and this is the part two and I'm doing um regulatory signs or prohibitory signs. So as you can see um all the warning signs were in the triangular form. So this rule science gives regulation. They prohibit you. They don't allow you to do certain things. So, as you can see, they are all in circular. circular. They are all in circular shapes. So, without mm, wasting much time, let's start. Our first sign is no right turn. No right turn means that you cannot turn to the right when you are on this road. You can't you can't you can't turn to the right when you're on this road. No right turn. There is no right turn on this road. So bear in mind. And this is no left turn, just like this. No left turn. No turning of left on this road. This is no U turn. You can't make a U turn on this road. I think typical example is that when you are coming from uh Infia Hotel this Roman Catholic area, SDA area, you can't make a U-turn or you have to go through the runabout before you can get back to the traffic light. So that is that, no U-turn. And this one is telling you no overtaking. You can't overtake. So no matter how this car, the, how slow this car is going, the red car can't overtake this car. <clears throat> no overtaking. And this is no parking no parking sign you cannot park here once you see the sign but however there is i don't know whether to say a trick or whatever let me show you some now this is the road this is the no parking sign now the what this sign is telling me is that i cannot park my car here this is my car land cruiser very nice i can't park my car here once I am looking at this sign and this sign is also looking at me. I cannot park here, but however, I can park behind this car. So far as once the place is safe, I can park behind of this car. It's good to go because this sign is not looking at me anymore and I'm not looking at him anymore. It means I can park behind of this car. Now, in a lorry station whereby they don't want anybody at all to park there, apart from this sign, some few meters they will put no parking some few meters they will put no parking so it means that when you park here the sign is looking at you when you park here you have the sign looking at you so you must always park behind the sign where there is where there is nothing looking at you that is no parking so if you want to park just park behind the sign assuming this one is wasn't here so you can park here but once there's a sign here you can't park here you can't park here so you park there if only it is a good place for you Bear in mind, this is no entry sign. It means you cannot enter. Probably the road is a one-way street. You cannot enter. No entry sign. Now, this is a um, vehicle weight limit. The weight of the vehicle. This is 10 ton. The team is ton. 10 ton. So it means that um, a vehicle above 10 ton cannot cross, cannot pass on that road. Most often you see a uh, Ghana highway with the van to check uh, They call it Azulu to check the weight of the car weight of the vehicle this bauxite trucks which carry bauxite from um, That place to port You see road, Ghana road highway most often with their van to check as a load so because of this sign so maybe once this sign is there it means that this, those people are also around checking the azure load weight of the vehicle so any car below this 10 ton 10 ton and below is good to go now this is um vehicle weight limit the weight of the vehicle this is the road one way street and this is my vehicle now the weight of my vehicle is 1.8 it means i'm good to go if it is 2.5 i'm good to go if my vehicle weight is maybe 3.5 you know the vehicle itself is bigger than this road so it means that um a special caution must be made 
when maybe you are carrying a very when maybe um the vehicle is very big bigger than this width is and you still has to you still have to go maybe an escort car must be in front of you to warn vehicles ahead at times they will even stop them stand aside the hard shoulder so that this car carrying a very big load can cross most often you see this taqua mines people carrying trucks excavators heavy machines that covers all the road and there will be an escort car to inform other drivers to stand aside so that is that now one trick is that when you see this 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 sign this small triangle where they are pointing means the width of the car the, the width of the road um the, the width of the vehicle sorry the width of the vehicle now the next one is the the height the vehicle height limit now see where the triangle is pointing telling you the height of the vehicle so five meters so you can see this sign when you are maybe approaching a bridge uh, an over overhead bridge or something maybe Kaneshi Takwari we don't have so Kaneshi bridge maybe this sign will be there to tell you the height of the bridge is five meters so vehicle below five meters are good to go but above five meters there will be a problem and this is no hooting that means no honey no PPPP I understand um, at court area there are no noise making so I think even at, in a town where a cell phone is there's a court there STMA court you see the sign there it means that no tax driver should horn no private car no car should horn so no horning and uh, I was also told I'm here to find out that hospital too they don't make on in there i'm here to find out about that but for the court i'm sure it is there right now this is no stopping it means that you cannot stop here you must just go and find a place to stop no stopping you can't stop here so bear in mind this is custom customs yeah this one is french customs so it's your issue whenever you are getting closer to the barrier the border maybe Takwadi here if I'm going to Elbo when you get to I think getting closer to Iziama or you know I'm not sure you see this sign there it means that there are custom people around to check smuggling and you know and stuff so customs it's it's a bit similar to the police but you come there and now and this sign is maximum speed limit is 50 it means that the maximum speed you can go on that road is 50 so if maybe I am I am on this road I'm going 80 and I see this sign here come I'm, I'm on I'm on this road I'm going 80 and I see 50 ahead of me I have to reduce my speed because maybe I am approaching a town I'm approaching a town so I have to reduce my speed anything at all can happen People can cross at any time so you must reduce your speed you can either go 50 or below 50 I would advise you go below 50 to save yourself save your car save whatever happened might happen okay now here is end of speed limit so after I have crossed the town I am now on the highway he says I can now go more than 50 and uh, it doesn't mean that your car goes 300 you drive a lambo 450 300 so you must just step on the gas and go 450 300 200 no just go a controllable speed a speed whereby when somebody just crosses you at any time you can just save your situation when your tire bust at any time you can just save yourself and save the situation so this sign is not just telling you to step on the gas go full speed just go a, a, a normal speed you can even go 50 on this road you can go 60 you can go 70 on this road but just go a controllable speed this is no waiting this sign is no waiting so you can this sign says no stopping and this one is a no waiting. so you cannot wait here uh, <clears throat> the, the the driver the minister the driver of the minister of the MP cannot wait for the minister of the MP <clears throat> on this road once you see this sign 
remember this time above the law so you can't wait here maybe you can stop here but you can't wait then you go no waiting bear in mind no waiting look at the difference no stopping this is no waiting now this is the police check symbol it's very similar to the custom the difference is that this is a bit triangular pointed this is circular so bear in mind so this is police check if you find this sign most often when you are getting closer to the barrier at times so they'll just write police ahead of you police barrier ahead of you if you don't see this symbol they will just write police barrier ahead of you so it's up to you to slow down you are getting closer to the police barrier slow down and just follow the instructions the police will give you and number 17 this is um close to all vehicles okay close to all vehicles both direction now it's trying to tell you that there is say obstacle there is a danger ahead this is the road going this way going that way and there is this sign here it means that close to all vehicle going all to all directions so I said, close to close to all vehicles both directions so maybe the road is closed temporarily maybe a construction anything at all an emergency anything at all has happened on the road so close to vehicles all vehicles it is actually close to all vehicles both direction that is that now um no entry for any power driven vehicles except two wheeled motorcycle without sidecar okay what this sign is trying to say is that um no entry for cars trucks like saloon cars pickups whatever no entry for them except for motorcycles i think motorcycles maybe a bobo is among this tricycle they are among but the sidecar means that if you could remember when you watch old war from german war from you see their moto comes with another small side car behind so that is the meaning of that side car the book is talking about and this is no entry for motorcycle so this on this particular road motorcycles cannot use it so it's a no calvin get out so it's a no entry for motorcycles on this road same applies to this no entry for bicycles so bicycles cannot and it's carbon bicycles cannot use this road as well and this is this one is um no entry for moped it's the same thing no entry for motorcycle this is no entry for goose vehicles as you can see no entry it means that goose ve carrying vehicles cannot enter there to offload their goose and stuff like that no entry for them no entry for any power driven vehicle drawing trailer other than a semi trailer or a single as a trailer <coughs> so <coughs> No entry, maybe um typical example is Kumasi station or the Takwa station. There is no entry for cargo cars, these big cargo cars, no entry for them to go there to upload or to load, no entry for them, except small small cars, you know. And talking about this sign as well, this no entry for um bicycles. I have witnessed a case whereby at Takwa station a military guy was riding a bicycle at the station whereas there was this sign there and one of the GPRTU guys stopped the military guy get him off from the bicycle and push the bicycle that is law no entry now here is no entry for pedestrian no crossing so if you're a pedestrian you don't have to enter from this side you do that with caution no entry for animal drawn vehicles i'm not sure we have something like this in ghana but it's no entry maybe in mexico you know where they have horses and stuff 
so that is that so no entry for them just bear in mind this is no entry for hard charts this looks like uh, you see these people uh, these guys those guys who sell the scraps that they are truck that trolley that they push that square bicycle thing that they push yeah hard chart so no entry for them as well no entry for maybe um wheelbarrows people now sell things on their wheelbarrows and stuff so no entry for such things <coughs> at the station but you know this is no entry for power dri power driven agriculture vehicle so that means tractor and stuff they can't enter this is no entry for power driven vehicles that means car moto they cannot enter from the side they can't go on this road and this is no entry for power driven vehicles or animal driven the same thing the same thing this is no entry for vehicles or combination of vehicles exceeding 30 feet length so exceeding 30 feet length so um this long vehicles articulated trucks that load cement that goes to ivory coast and stuff no entry for them this long 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 trucks and stuff no entry for them so that is that well um thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you have you now know the meaning of this road signs and uh, part three will be done shortly we are now coming to do the informatory signs that is that so stay tuned and uh, leave your comment below please subscribe to this channel press on the subscribe button press on the bell make sure the bell rings so that um, you will get to receive new videos that I put on my channel car consult and also if you want to contact me you can just find me at gmail.com that is seventh billionaire this is how the seventh is written seventh billionaire billionaire small letters at gmail.com so any questions any suggestions whatever i'm here for you so we also teach people driving and if you are also interested in driving you can also contact us we will help you we will take you on the field you know we currently don't have i don't need, currently use my car but if you have your own car yeah you can call me like i'm doing that to some people as well they have their own car and we go on the road so that is car console so thank you guys for watching thank you and stay tuned